What's your uh, thoughts right now? Uh, yeah, obviously, I'm massively delighted. Uh, that was a difficult day for us, a hard day. Um, started the game really well, had that massive chance, and um, there we have to be on that level because on that level we're not getting so many chances, so we need to be clinical, and I think that would have settled our nerves uh, early on. Uh, but we didn't, and uh, so then we got a little bit passive. Um, we had a lot of the ball, but we in the back, but we we didn't play good enough through the lines um, or into the front man. Um, Cluj didn't threaten us, but obviously they are a threat on set pieces, and I said it several times. Um, used one of those opportunities, and then first twenty minutes in second half was first class. That was our best period in the game where. It, where we was attacking and uh, I encouraged the players to take more chances. And um, and then I think we bombarded them. They couldn't come out of their half. Um, we got the goal and um, then they got the red card. And then in the end, we we had that one-man advantage and we, uh, we got it over the line. What uh, were you uh, specifically happy with in that good period, and, and what do you have uh, to say about? I felt that especially Arno. Arno was a, a little bit passive in the first uh, 45 minutes uh, because he's one, in our offensive play. I think he's very, very important, and uh, and he has shown that in that period very impressively. Uh, I also think Eric Larsen on that side he put a lot of pressure on, and we came a lot of in a lot of good areas where we didn't in the first half, and. Um, I'm delighted. I think we had enough chances um, uh, to kill the game off. Um, not as many as we had uh, in previous games, um, but who ask? You know, today I think it's uh, it's all about um, getting further. And now the players have two and a half days off, and I think that will do them the world of good. What goes on in a coach's head uh, when we score a goal like that? Are you directly focused to go further? I think. Uh, is a fantastic for the player first and foremost, obviously for the team, and um, and also most importantly also for the supporters. They come here to to see uh, goals like that and and the team winning. And like I said after the Saturday game, the crowd play a massive massive part with us. And I think we we try to get that symbiosis between us two, um, the players, the staff, and the crowd. And I think uh, the better that is. The stronger that is, that will help us also through difficult periods, because they will come at some point, and um, they be magnificent, and uh, and the players really, really, really appreciate uh, their support. Now we have a new home game in the Champions League in a few days. Do you have anything you want to say to the supporters? Yeah, first we have to see who we play against, uh, and uh, I'm sure, I'm sure uh, we will uh, the amount of people will increase again, and. Um, and then we see, I think, in that level now, the the level of op opponents get better and better. Um, the air get thinner and thinner, and uh, we have to we have to be at top of our game um, to to come f through the next round. And I think we need to also a little bit luck on our side as well with injuries and with players availability because today we need to do substitute two players because of um, medical issues. You said uh, in the press conference that uh, you give the players two days off now. How do you celebrate yourself? Two and a half days and I also give myself uh, two and a half days off.